Ancient Mountains Sheltered by Evergreen Forests Twisting Streams and Quiet Waters Expansive Wetlands Abundant with Life The Canaan Valley National Wildlife Refuge is a place that feels like wilderness, diverse in animal and plant life, the valley appears wild and untouched. Stretching 10 miles long by as much as three miles wide, it is the largest wetland in West Virginia. And at 3,200 feet in elevation, one of the highest valleys in Appalachia. In the late 1800s, Canaan Valley was one of the last unsettled places in the eastern United States. The dense evergreen and hardwood forests were a lumberman's dream. Before railroads gained access to the area, logging was limited by the means of transporting the immense trees. The nearby town of Davis became the industrial hub for timbering in and around Canaan Valley. The men who worked in the forest were awed by the massive trees that would crash to the ground. From the 1880s to 1920, millions of board feet of lumber were removed from Canaan Valley until every large tract of timber was cut. Canaan Valley had been devastated. The economic poverty that followed compelled Valley residents who remained to search for a new source of income. As the signs of industrialism faded and the valley regrew, the natural beauty and cold winters started to lure people back to the valley. After decades of working with the community and advisory groups, the Canaan Valley National Wildlife Refuge was established in 1994. Where timber had once floated on the Blackwater River, Kayaks now drift on the quiet waters. Named for its dark water, the Blackwater River flows through the valley collecting water that escapes the beaver dams and trickles off the mountainsides. The river cuts and meanders through wooded hills and switches back upon itself as it makes its way out of the valley and into the Blackwater Canyon. The wetlands and bogs of Canaan Valley are home to special colonies of plants uniquely suited to grow in wetlands. The forests overlooking the valley have the look and feel of the far north. Ferns shelter beneath mountaintop spruce forests and the deep mossy undergrowth provides homes for many forms of life. Winters in the valley are cold and snow covers the ground for much of the winter. Spring wildflowers announce the end of winter. 
Green replaces white as wildflowers color the landscape. The valley continues its cycle through summer as wildlife perform their tasks. Plants flower, and rainstorms replenish the valley wetlands. Fall colors appear early in the mountains. Bright leaves carpet the forest floor. Late blooming plants ripen and display the beauty of seasonal change. Over the last 100 years, the destruction of the spruce forests and the eventual regrowth of Canaan Valley tell a story of a fragile yet resilient landscape. The uniqueness and complexity of life in Canaan Valley provide endless combinations of beauty and inspiration for all who visit. <laughs>